I'll send you start with the toughest game you could in this group. It looks like that because there is a great atmosphere here, a good team and a very dynamic team as well. So they play a little bit of a similar game to ours. Should be exciting, attractive and hopefully uh, we'll be capable to dominate the game because uh, I think to leave them the ball will be dangerous. Have you been getting some tips from Pierre Mertz Saka? Well, he knows them well. I know them well as well. And uh, at the end of the day, I believe uh, it's very important this kind of game that you focus on you playing well more than being obsessed too much by your opponent because uh, uh, we, have, uh, we have the habit to play away from home. We uh, know how to behave and uh, I think should we repeat a similar performance to Udinese, we have a good chance. What's going to be the most frustrating thing for you about this touchline ban and not being around the team? Well, to be physically separated because sometimes they know me so well, the players, that uh, they detect quickly uh, what I want. And uh, to be physically separated from the team is very uh, difficult for me because it's very unusual. And uh, especially here, I think uh, you're far away from uh, on the other side of the bench and uh, you cannot even uh, see the reactions of your own staff, you know. So, but we have to cope with it. Do you have a blueprint for substitutions if you're winning, player X maybe comes off and player Y comes on? We speak about all that before the game, but then again, uh, in football it's so much unexpected that I will have to leave that to Pat Rice uh, to make the right decision at the right moment. I trust him completely. I have no problem on that front. It's more my frustration that is uh, a bit bad to take. So many comings and goings during the summer. Does this feel almost like a new chapter for you in Arsenal's history, in your history? For you, uh, for us, it's the first time we feel uh, really as a unit and uh, as a team where everybody's focused on achieving things together. So psychologically, it's for certainly for the group a new start before we had some players who were not completely in. And of course, that's uh, not the best way to prepare the season. But uh, yeah. We wish you good luck. Thank you. Wojciech beaten by a wonder goal late on, but overall happy with the points? Uh, I think it's well deserved. Uh, you know, we were under a lot of pressure in the in second half. Uh, they will think they, they deserved the draw. And, you know, sometimes they go in from 20 yards, uh, top corner, and you, you take that. Do you see much of it? Uh, no, I saw it ending up in, in the top corner and I didn't even move, so uh, I believe I had no chance. <laughs> Bakary, was it a night when Arsenal had to show their defensive capabilities, a lot of defensive work, particularly in the second half? Yeah, of course. Uh, we knew we were playing against a quality team. They showed tonight they can play good football, but uh, we, I think we responded well. We defended as a team from forward to, to defend defenders, but uh, we are a bit unlucky to concede this crazy goal, and uh, yeah, you, you have to take it and, uh, and look forward for the, for the next game. Was it strange not having Arsene Wenger in the dressing room before the game or even at half time? Yeah, it's always special, but I think uh, Patrice did well. He gave us a lot of advices, and uh, I think we tried to, to apply them on the pitch. So I hope next time the, the boss will be with, with us, it will be a bit more easier to, 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 to speak to them. Wojciech, was it strange for you not to have the boss in the changing room? Uh, I mean, as, as Bucky said, Pat Rice did a great job. Uh, he, he's got the ability to motivate the team. Uh, he shouts a lot and, and uh, he got us going. So uh, it, it was strange in a way, but uh, I think credit to Pat, uh, he did very well. It's been a difficult start to the season, to put it mildly. Is this sort of the, the start of something better, the beginning of something, do you feel? Uh, yeah, I think, I think we showed uh, on Saturday uh, against Swansea that uh, we know how to play football, we know how to win games. Uh, Today was a very tough fixture uh, and, and overall I think we should be happy with the performance and, and uh, if we keep it going then there's good things to come for us. Bakri, putting it into context, Arsenal in recent years away from home in the Champions League have, have been poor, lost a lot of games, so at the end of the day a point looks pretty good. Yeah, I think it's a good point because uh, it's not easy to, to, to take some points in Dortmund. We knew they, they were a good team, they, they did well last year. So we're expecting this kind of game, we had it and but, uh, I think uh, we can be happy with this point.